Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hope you're doing well. So, I often talk about aromatherapy in my videos. I think your home having a very comforting atmosphere is important for mental health and having a sort of welcoming environment for your husband when he comes from the outside world. And it also teaches your children to make their home a nest, a safe abode, a sanctuary. So, uh, this is a candle my husband bought me because while the baby's taking a nap, I said, pick me up, just pick something, a candle, anything, <laughs> surprise me, because I can't go with you because I want the baby to take a nap. Shout out to moms who know nap time. And he picked me the Sicilian lemon, and it's very refreshing. Uh, this is a bit more of a summer scent, I'd argue. Spring, summer. Uh, we're out of winter, so you don't really nece necessarily need the spice, pine, wood aromas going on, or leather. But this one, it's, it's very bright and moody. And I'm going to light this after the video. It smells absolutely wonderful. The thing I like about Yankee Candle, even though they're not made by hand, they're made by machines. But what I will compliment them on is the, the, the scent throw. So how far the scent reaches. Now, uh, you don't want to put these Yankee on when you're cooking. Definitely after, okay? Because you don't want to combine the smell of your cooking with the scent of the candle. Uh, but while you're reading, I do recommend you have the candle within vision because there's something about watching a flame move, like move, the lights are dim, it's just very relaxing and inviting instead of having bright lights, you know, just shining in your face. Uh, having a relaxing candle mood creates more of a soothing, harmonious environment. And so, if you haven't tried this kind, now I've had, Yan I've had a lot of Yankee candles, okay? So, this one... I just wanted to bring it to your attention and consider it. I think lemon would go good when you're done cooking fish, uh, personally. Because fish, especially shrimp, can be quite stinky. And after you peel hard-boiled eggs, the aroma smells like farts in the air for a while. <laughs> so uh, <laughs> you can use that. And also remember, uh, due to Yankee Candle, uh, having a, a strong scent throw. If you have parrots like me, you light the candle, but you need to have oops, uh, the windows cracked a bit to create a flow. Some studies have shown that uh, scented candles can kill parrots, but uh, my parrots have yet to die because of that. You know, I light candles quite often, but there's always great ventilation in my home. I always have nice fans on. The windows cracked, you know, I keep air flowing. It's not uh, stale, stagnant, humid, groggy, uh, you know. I like fresh air. So that's probably why, you know, I don't have that problem with parrots. But some people, I understand, they just close everything. And that's not good. And, uh, yeah, it's up to you. If you don't have uh, parrots, I um, wouldn't worry about it. Remember to keep candles out of reach of children. And have a fun scent journey.